Okay, I'm gonna show you a common problem with Chip that I got today while trying to work with uh, my bot like GBFR. And whenever I get some kind of file and I try to open it, uh, usually you should see settings like that. And if I have a file that I saved from um, my device, which for example I have one here, if I go to the settings, uh, there is a Python. Uh, Python, which is a programming language, uh, error non-type object is non-iterable, and settings cannot load. You can also see it if you go to a uh, debug log, and at the end of the debug log, you will see that the value that it encountered, probably while saving um, the file from the radio, uh, is that the value is not in range. And what happens is that uh, when it writes it to a file, uh, it probably forgets about some part of this file. And I found a way how to fix it. Uh, you need two things. You need one of those report files that you can get from uh, basically that website, um, which is the chip on that bullet. And there are some fixes for different radios. You just have to find the one file that is fixed. Uh, for that, I use software which is called HXD, which is a hex editor, editor of the internals of, of any kind of file. Uh, and what I do, is I get my own file that has some kind of problems and a file that is prepared. After you find your software name, which is this part, you get everything up to your model of your radio, copy that uh, using Ctrl C shortcut. There will be a prompt that there is uh, some missing characters, but that's, that's not a problem, because internally it will work exactly as you, as you want. And then you get into the same place within your uh, within your hex file and you paste it and then you save it. After you save it, you can go into uh, your downloads folder and you can open that file. And this is the same file that I had problems with, these are settings for my, um, my radio basically. And if I go to settings, uh, I can open them uh, once again. For me, it started because I wanted to disable the uh, transmission in my radio because I don't have license yet. So I clicked on TX enabled and TX enabled to, to disable them and to see if you can uh, if you can lock it. Then I tried to program my radio and everything failed and caused the error that I showed you uh, a few seconds ago.